Hey what's up guys welcome to another video in which we are going to write python program to swap two variables so guys over here there are two ways in order to swap two variables in python basically first of all we are going to use a temporary variable in order to swap two variables and secondly we are going to see how we can swap two variables without using a temporary variable so guys let us move to the vs code over here so what we will do is let's say we have two numbers over here x it is equal to 10 and then let's say we provide y it is equal to 20 so guys what we will do is we will simply print the values of x and y before swapping so we say print and then inside this we have the values of x and y are we will provide open and close curly braces and then followed by comma and then again open and close curly braces and then after this we will provide format over here so dot format and we simply provide the x and y variables over here x comma y so guys these parameters in the format function will help us to print the values x and y by using these open and close curly braces over here and then we missed out one thing that is the values of x and y are after printing the values we have to provide before swapping so over here we provide before swapping label so that we come to know that these are the values before swapping so guys let me just save this file now and try running this code so as you can see the values of x and y are 10 comma 20 before swapping now guys let us say we want to swap the values of these two variables which means we want to assign this value that is 20 to x and then the value of x which was 10 should be assigned to this variable that is y so what we can simply do is we can use a temporary variable so we can have temp it is equal to x so basically first of all we are storing this value that is 10 to the temporary variable and then we will assign this value 20 to the variable x over here so what we can simply is equal to y so after this statement we have 20 as the value for x and for the variable y we still have the value 20 so we need to get the value of 10 over here for the y variable which we can get by using this temp variable that we have just used here equal to temp in this case so guys first of all we are assigning the value of 10 that is x to temp so that we can temporarily store the value that is 10 over here then we are assigning the value of y which is 20 to the variable that is x and then again to the variable y we are assigning the value of temp which is having the value as 10 in this case so guys over here what we can do is simply we can copy this line that is a print statement and after all these three operations we can paste it over here the values of x and y are we will get the x and y values and over here we simply have to do after swapping so we have not changed anything inside this print statement but we are only changing the label over here so now we should get 20 and then 10 in this case for the values of x and y variables now let me just save this file now and try running this code so as you can see the values of x and y are 10 comma 20 before swapping so that is what we had assigned over here initially but after swapping which means after carrying out these three operations we are getting the values of x and y are 20 comma 10 after swapping so guys we have successfully swapped both the variables in this case that is the values of x and y have been swapped successfully now guys there is another way in order to swap the variables that is without using the temporary variable so what we can do is we can simply remove these lines of code but by using just one line of code over here we can simply swap both the variables so over here what we can do is we provide x followed by comma and then we provide y it is equal to simply what we can do is we can swap the two variables over here so first of all we have to provide y and then followed by comma and then we have x so guys what exactly we are doing is the value of y should be assigned to x in this case and the value of x should be assigned to y in this case and that is what the meaning of this expression is so after this expression gets executed we will have the swap operation successful so guys let me just save this file now and try running this code so as you can see we are getting the values of x and y are 10 and 20 before swapping and then again we are getting the values of x and y are 20 comma 10 after swapping so guys successfully we were able to swap both the variables over here as we can see so guys practice on your own so that on different inputs you get different outputs please make sure that you like this video so that it reaches to more people and subscribe to this channel so that you get the notifications on upcoming videos as well the next video that we are going to talk about is python program to generate random numbers so stay tuned